Hey guys, okay, I'm back. Again, it's Saturday, March 9th, 2013. So this video, I am going to just talk about, I guess, just different workout hairstyles for women with natural hair because I know that that's always an issue with us. We don't want to mess up our hair or anything like that. So I just wanted to share some different options of things that you can do. So if you follow a girl came back on Instagram, I think so far I've posted about two pictures of different hairstyles that I wear when I am exercising. And I've done them on loose twists because that's just how I've been wearing my hair all winter. But they these styles can be done on loose hair as well. They can be done with locked hair. Um, yeah, so they're versatile. So the I'm going to share with you the style that I have now which is really easy so I have loose twists in my hair and all I did was I put them in a ponytail using a hairband I guess you could call it a hairband a hair a hair sock <laughs> kind of thing so what I used is an old um, old pair of stockings that I had the top part and I just I cut it like it's it's pretty thick this band is pretty pretty thick um, maybe I'll do a tutorial showing you how to make them they're really really easy you know how people make the the hair bands to make puffs the small ones out of an old uh, pair of stockings or whatever you just make it wider that's all that's really it and then you just cut it and you've got a circle and you just pull it through this is also really good especially if your twists are not uh, very long and you can't actually get it into a ponytail you can put it up in a little puff like thing like this and it'll just push all the hair to the top of your head with this hair hair sack oh hair tube that's what I call these hair tubes so because it's long like a tube it's a circular tube of fabric you can also make this tube so that if you wanted to put your hair down into a low ponytail you can do that as well I just like mine up high because I don't like anything on my neck I like it up and out of my face so I'll turn to the side so you can kinda see what the little tube looks like and you see how it comes I pull mine all the way up so that's why if you had shorter hair it'll it'll put it all the way up and you won't have to worry about any stray hairs coming out and then here's the other side and so that's it the hair tube um, I'll probably do a post about this because again the lighting isn't that great in here so I'm not sure if you were able to really see that uh, I say uh, a lot I have to work on that so another hairstyle that I also do on my hair whether it's loose or in twist is I'll do just simply two flat twists or you could do two French braids and yeah I just two and then what I do is I pin up the sides and just tuck them in so my ends aren't out and again so it's not you know on my neck or anything like that and super easy and that's pretty much another hairstyle that you can do if your hair is shorter as long as you have enough hair that you can grab to put in a, a French braid, you can do this style. I think if your hair is, you know, in a TWA or anything like that, you kind of don't have to worry about this just yet. Uh, you can just kind of let your hair do what it do. I know when I had really, really short hair and I worked out, I didn't even worry about it. I might have wearing wore a little headband in the front, but I think most of the time I didn't even do that. So, but I think the easiest is just to put it up in a puff like this. And this is good if you also have like a twist out or a braid out because this kind of creates that pineapple effect. So it will actually keep your, whatever curl pattern you set, it'll keep it in place. And again, it will keep it out of your face and off your neck. So really when you're done working out and you've completely cooled down and everything, when you take this off, you really should be able to just kind of fluff it and get it back and it should be you know fine so those are two options as far as workout hairstyles if I come up with any more I'll let you know but these are the main reliable ones that I use and they're perfect 
I don't have any issues. Um, some other options that you can do, one last one, that I told one of my friends recently, she's like, well, I don't know what to do with my hair and this and that. I said, what you can also do is, if your hair is long enough, if your twists are long enough to get in a ponytail, put your hair in some chunky twists. Gather them into a ponytail, tie a scarf around the front, you're good to go. You know, don't make it rocket science. And really, if you're there, to, if you're at the gym or wherever to exercise, you shouldn't get that caught up in how you look because it's about it's about working out. I mean, if you want to be jazzy, put a colorful, tie a colorful scarf around your head. So that's a good option if you wear your hair loose a lot and you exercise in the morning and you don't know what to do. Put it in some chunky twists and gather in a ponytail. Tie a scarf around the top and you're good to go. So I definitely want to talk about fitness more. I'm really excited about it. I used to be very active as a kid and I think like a lot of people, once you graduate school, college, it's really hard sometimes. It's not as big of a focus for some of us because you get caught up in working and life and paying bills and you know, next thing you know you've gained 15 pounds, 20 pounds and you're like, what's going on here? So I really have made the commitment to just make fitness a part of my life and that's how it's going to be you know I want to be 60 years old looking 40 so <laughs> I'm just saying you know that's what I want so that's what I'm gonna go for but it, it's about our health it's about our health and hopefully these hairstyle ideas were helpful and simple I like to keep things simple so yeah if you guys have any questions definitely leave them below in the comments and I will see you guys next time. Bye!